Shalom and welcome back to Code Searcher. All right, so I wanted to share something with you guys. Um, in this table that I'm working, it's called um, Ovi Hakora, which is the, uh, based on the documentary that I posted not too long ago called The Other Side of the Cross. So I found this table and um, I wanted to share it with you, even at this stage, which is um, hasn't been worked so much. Um, based on the From Golgotha table that you've already seen, and we'll, we'll cover this in just a minute. This was about Ron Wyatt and the Ark of the Covenant. Um, as you can see there, I'll back it up. Some of you saw this already. Um, but I pulled it out because of the anomaly I found in this table. Because we have here is the other side of the cross, um, which of course is talking about Yeshua. Here's his name, Yeshua, and he was on the cross. Hu Natslav, he was on the cross, which is six letters, seven letters, excuse me. And right up, first of all, what I had highlighted above that. I uh, didn't necessarily have anything to do with the cru crucifixion, but the defeat of the the um, uh, the veils by Elijah, and this is where he called Elijah called down fire. Um, I saw it as the same kind of parallel with Yeshua on the cross. He was basically uh, defeating the enemy. Um, what we have here, he was uh, the, the men they smoked him, which that actually happened to Yeshua. Um, the Holy One of Israel is here a couple of times. Three times, exactly. Yeshua's name is also down here. But also, Hanatsri, which is the uh, the Netsri, or the root, or the remnant. I also got Mashiach in there as well, with Goala, and Zophon, hidden. But this is what I wanted to show you here. <clears throat> We have the blood going one direction, going down, and going up is Nekri. So we have it like this, which is the crevice. And we have Netzer under that, and also the covenant here. Um, but what was really interesting, and I'm not going to cover the rest of it, because this is, this table's, um, there's still so much still to, to come of it. So I just want to just point out this one verse right there that goes through the blood and the crevice, which is going in the other direction. Um, some of you Ron Wyatt people will appreciate this. The blood in the crevice. Interesting. So we got Isaiah 52. Verse 13 is what I have highlighted there. Um, Behold, my servant shall deal prudently. He shall be exalted and extolled and very high. As many were astonished at thee, his visage was so marred more than any man, and his form more than, any, more than the sons of men. So shall he sprinkle many nations the kings shall shut their mouths at him, for that which had not been told them shall they see, and they that which not which they had not heard shall they consider. And then, of course, it goes into Isaiah 53, which is explicitly about Yeshua. Uh, so, back to Ron Wyatt. From Golgotha, of course, is um, the access term that uh, I was searching uh, to kind of, uh, you know, vet his story, uh, and this was what, what came of that, and it was a very small skip, 4670, it appeared in roughly um, all of, of Levit Leviticus, um, so we're in where um, the sacrifice is established, it's, uh, you know, the mercy seat is sprinkled, um, so Yeshua, the high priest, if you will, sprinkle the nations when he gave himself as a sacrifice. So what do we have here uh, from Golgotha? And we have the altar right there. He sprinkles the altar. He sprinkles the mercy seat. 
which is also in here, by the way, is found, runs right through there in the white letters. Uh, we've got the hidden and redemption sharing a letter. Uh, Yeshua also is in here. Where is it? Right up here. And I thought it was in the plain text as well, yes. Uh, as well as here, crossing with Elijah. Um, Elijah's also down here. Uh, we've got the Ark and Atonement running through there. Uh, crucifixion is there twice, crossing itself. Um, this is interesting here. Uh, the blood is sufficient. Um, when you have lamb and altar that cross each other, uh, you got Yeshua's name in there, Mashiach, and Mashiach in the other direction. Um, Passover, of course it happened at Passover. Um, Mashiach is there as well. Words of Yahuwah. Ark of the Covenant is in here. And the Maccabees. Uh, it, is, um, it is believed that the Ark was hidden in a grotto by uh, Jeremiah during the time of the Babylonian um, invasion. So uh, this kind of reveals that in this table. Ron Wyatt name appears uh, reversed on itself. You see Ron Wyatt stomping right there. Um, and I cannot see what that is. I think that's an altar in there. So, I just thought it was interesting, another uh, inadvertently uh, a table validates and vets this one as well. So, uh, will it reappear? I believe so. Um, I believe it will be a, a witness, if you will, um, against those that are trespassing against the law. So, um, folks, if you haven't already, um, please support the cause. Uh, join Jonathan's fight to restore my sons and those that have already supported the, uh, the cause in, in your financial support. I want to thank you in this video, but you'll also be getting a, a written thank you from us. Um, we are using another um, fundraising site because the one we were started with had a policy that we could not use it um, for legal reasons. Uh, but we found one that we could use so that there is some sort of oversight. You can see what we are taking in um, for this for this cause. Um, it's been two years since I've seen or talked to my children, so it's very important that we win this battle and then return to me. Um, there's a, a huge injustice here. So, uh, may Yeshua bless you, folks. Keep us in prayer. Uh, if you want to donate, you can do so down below. The link is there for um, the legal fund or the regular donations. We thank you and we love you. Shalom.